How's it going YouTube? I want to bring you guys something really uh, that I'm really super excited about that uh, the folks at Bill Lewis has come out with this year. Of course, Rattletrap, the company Rattletrap, Bill Lewis, um, you probably formerly know it as Bill Lewis Outdoors, they're synonymous for making the lipless crankbait, the Rattletrap. You know, that's what it's, the foundation of the company was built on the Rattletrap. And you know, over the last five or six years ago, again, to expand that product line. Um, you guys saw we came out with the Echo 175 a couple years ago. It's been a phenomenal crankbait, really performed really well. It's a tool that I use all the time, um, fishing at home, fishing on tournament trail. It's just a really, really unique crankbait. Um, I think it's one of those special crankbaits that just fits a lot of different situations out there that a normal square bill crankbait won't work in. And then last year we launched the uh, the stutter step, we started getting into some of the topwater baits out there. Um, and one of the things that that I expressed that I, I definitely wanted to uh, to have in my tackle box a mid-range diving crankbait. I wanted something that I could use to crank around laydowns, something that I could use to beat the bank with, to fish bluff banks with, parallel uh, bluff banks, something I could use to throw around docks, those little bit deeper docks, something that I could use in that deeper depth zone other than a square bill. Sometimes a square bill is a great crankbait to use when you're fishing here, you know, here. But I wanted something that I could fish, you know, in that four, five, six, seven foot range um, that's a little bit more versatile, something I can use in clear water, stain water. Um, and we worked on this project a lot, a lot of phone conversations back and forth on colors and design and what the profile of the bait would look like. And uh, we got it. We got it. This is the brand new MR6. When we came up with the MR6, you know, there's a couple things that I'm going to look for, special things like I do with every bait. There's a couple things that I'm going to look for when I'm looking for a mid-range diving crankbait. Number one, I'm the kind of guy when you're talking about a crankbait, a four to six foot diving crankbait, this is something I'm gonna be fishing around shallow structure. Things that I can see, visual targets, rocks, I'm gonna fish around laydowns, I'm gonna fish around block, uh, you know, anything that I can visually see is where I'm gonna throw this crankbait. So right off the bat, one thing that it has to be, it has to deflect off of cover very well and that's one thing the MR6 does. It has a really tight wiggle um, but it has just enough build, the right size and the right shape build that this bait, it just crawls over structure. That's, I gotta have that because I know I'm gonna be fishing around visual targets. I'm gonna bump it into stuff. I'm gonna dig it down into the rocks. I'm gonna really be abusive with the way that I use this crankbait. So it's gotta be durable. It's gotta be a bait that stays together. You know, I can't have the bill falling out of it or like a lot of the, your wood balsam baits do. This is injected molded product. It's pretty much plastic. So you don't have to worry about it falling apart on you, the bill coming out of it. I need the bait to run true and it's gonna do all of those things. Second thing is I like a really tight wiggle. This bait's gonna be in stores this fall. I hope you guys will try it out. I'm telling you, I really got a faith. I think we got a winner here, guys. I fished this thing a lot this spring. I've really kind of kept it a secret. I haven't really talked a lot about it. The production model is gonna be out this fall. You're gonna to wanna to have this. This is gonna be one of those crankbaits that at the end of the day, you're gonna look back 10, 15 years ago and be like, man, you remember when Bill Lewis came out with the MR6. This is gonna be one of those. It's just gonna be a staple in the crankbait market. I, I look forward to maybe even expanding this crankbait market to an MR6, an MR, MR10, um, maybe even an MR4, because I love the profile of this bait so much. I love the action of it. I think we got a winner here. Comes through structure so really, uh, so good. It's just gonna be a bait that's gonna be very versatile. You're gonna be able to use it in a lot of different situations and you're gonna have to have it if you wanna be competitive out there. You wanna maximize your time on the water. MR6, Bill Lewis, look for it at the stores this fall. Of course, you're gonna see me fishing it. And, um, and I'm gonna inform you on everything that I think about this new bait. It's a real good one. Check it out.